Hello my dear supporters, and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're diving into how to add a boss menu management system for all your jobs. This isn't your ordinary management tool. This system lets you view work hours, see which employees are online, and even deposit money into the society fund. Another fantastic feature is the built-in job application script. Let's check out how to add this script and boost your server's functionality. To kick off the process of integrating this exciting and dynamic update into your 5M server, start by visiting the GitHub page, which we've made easily accessible through the link provided in the video description. Once you're on the page, locate the necessary files and download them to your computer. After downloading, extract the contents from the zip folder to access all the required files. Once the extraction is complete, Carefully transfer the entire folder into the appropriate directory within your server's configuration that suits its structure and setup. Finally, make a minor adjustment by renaming the folder. Simply remove the word main from the folder's name and your setup will be ready to move forward seamlessly. Inside the script folder, you'll find an SQL file that needs to be imported into your database. I'm using HeidiSQL on my local host setup, but if you're using a different tool, like phpMyAdmin, just follow your tool's process for importing SQL files. This step is crucial to ensure that all the necessary data tables are set up correctly for the windmill system to function properly. All right, let's integrate the QB banking snippet into your server. First, head over to the GitHub page where you'll find the QB banking snippet and go ahead and copy it. Next, Open your server directory and navigate to the QB folder. Once you're in, open the QB banking folder, then go into the server folder and open the server.lua file. Now paste the copied snippet anywhere within the server.lua file and be sure to save your changes. And that's it. You're all set with the QB banking integration. After extensive testing and productive discussions, I'm thrilled to announce that Rocketnode and Codeine are now official partners. We recognize the critical importance of providing top-tier hosting services to ensure your players enjoy an exceptional 5M experience. Rocketnode comes with DDoS protection, 24-7 support, and cloud backups. They offer extremely customizable 5M server hosting, allowing you to create your own server with just one click. Their easy-to-use control panel makes it simple to set up and modify your 5M server. If you're tired of searching for a reliable provider for your community, start building with Rocketnode today. Make sure to use the link in the description and get a 25% discount on your server by using the promo code provided below. Don't miss out on this great opportunity to enhance your server with a reliable hosting solution. Let's take a look at the configuration file and explore what it has to offer. At the top, you'll find a section dedicated to the banking snippet configuration, where the script determines which banking resource to use, like QB banking or another option. This section is essential for integrating the proper banking functionalities into your server. As you scroll further down, you'll see various script options that allow you to control different features, giving you the flexibility to enable or disable functions based on your server's needs. Shortly after, the file introduces the settings for the built-in job application system. This part lets you toggle the job application feature on or off, depending on whether you want players to be able to apply for jobs within the game. Towards the bottom, you'll notice detailed settings for management access locations. These settings include coordinates, dimensions, and headings that define the exact spots in your game world where players can access boss menus and job management features. Overall. This configuration file is designed to give you comprehensive control over the various functionalities of your script, from banking integration and job applications to defining in-game access points for management. Feel free to adjust these settings to perfectly tailor the experience to your server's unique gameplay style. Now, let's head over to the police department to check out the brand new boss menu. If you ever get confused, Remember that the coordinates are available in the config file. Once you open it up, you'll be greeted by a dashboard displaying all the essential information about the police department, everything from total employees to work hours, and more. On the left side of the dashboard, you can navigate to various sections. Start with employee management, then move on to society funds. 
where you have the option to deposit or completely withdraw funds. There's also a Permissions tab that lets you assign specific roles and actions to players within the boss menu. One of the really cool features is the ability to transfer money directly from the Society Fund to a player's account. Plus, you get access to the department's job application system directly from the boss menu. And if you want to give it your personal touch, you can even customize the color of the boss menu through the settings to match your preferred theme. Now, if you go through the config file, you'll see the coordinates for the job application area. This is where players can submit their applications for the defined jobs. I really like this concept because it adds a whole new level of immersion. When a player applies, they're prompted with a series of questions to answer. Once the application is completed, it gets sent directly to the boss menu. In the boss menu, the recruiter can open and review the application along with all the answers. From there, the recruiter has the power to accept or reject the application on the spot. It's a really cool feature that brings an interactive and engaging element to the script. And that wraps up our deep dive into the job application feature and boss menu management. I hope you enjoyed the walkthrough and found it useful. If you did, please hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and ring the bell to stay updated on all our future tutorials. Thanks for watching, happy gaming, and I'll see you in the next video. I'm thrilled to announce that Codeine has officially surpassed 7,000 members on Discord, making it one of the best 5M developers and server owners hubs. Fueled by this increase in member count, we've added developer AI bots to help fix code snippets for users facing issues. Moreover, users can also create logos for their servers using our logo-creating AI bots. With support for all frameworks from thousands of developers, you'll also find all the necessary free items needed to start a simple roleplay server. So what's stopping you from joining? Join now!